Hi, welcome to Innovation and Design Thinking, MCQ, with explanations for Module 1 Innovation and Culture Explore presentation designers across the globe. 1. The Wang et al. study of 2005 concludes that innovation activities in Germany are more clearly divided. B. Scheduled. C. Sequential. D. All of the above. Answer. D. Explanation, Wang et al. 2005 made comparison between Germany and China on innovation management. This study concluded that innovation activities in Germany more clearly sequential, divided, and scheduled, whereas the innovation activities in China are overlapping. 2. The 1998 studies of Karana and Rosenthal suggest that the Japanese firms are more in which of these design approach? A. Formal. B. Casual. C. Holistic. D. Unconcerned. Answer, C. Explanation, studies of Karana and Rosenthal in 1998 brought out the cultural differences in new product development that holistic approach in Japan firms and formality approach in US firms. This study supporting the belief that, design practices may vary by culture. 3. It is difficult to incorporate the customer perspective in Chinese economy due to Buddhism B. Confucianism. C. Jainism. D. Sufism. Answer. B. Explanation. Article by Zhao et al. in 2006 on economic development in China conclude that in China it is difficult in incorporating the customer perspectives. This is because of Confucianism one and may adhere more to supervision and rules. This directly affecting the design thinking in China. Confucianism, also known as Ruism, is a system of thought and behavior originating in ancient China. Variously described as tradition, a philosophy, a religion, a humanistic or rationalistic religion, a way of governing, or simply a way of life, Confucianism developed from what was later called the Hundred Schools of Thought from the teachings of the Chinese philosopher Confucius. 4. Asian clients expect to get in order to improve the client-consultant relationship. Extra. Free service. Progress reports D. None of these. Answer. A. Explanation. According to the designers, Asian clients were described as wanting the design consultancy to work on the project and deliver a final design based on their own counsel. In addition, contracts with Asian clients tended to be more fluid and there was an expectation of getting extras as a show of strength in the relationship. 5. In the clients are collaborative with the designers. Asia. B. Europe. C. Korea. D. North America. Answer. D. Explanation, according to the designers, in North America, the relationship with the client was described as collaborative. 6. Study shows that the Asian clients are more a. Process-oriented, b. Concerned, c. Result-oriented, d. Unconcerned. Answer, c. Explanation, research concludes that, with regard to process as a legitimate deliverable, Asian clients were said to not care about how the designers approach the design activities. One informant is that, they don't care, about, the process, just show me the cool stuff. 7. By being creative Asian clients still prefer products that are a. Same of existing products. b. Out of the box. c. Fit with the stream of existing products. d. None of the above. Answer. c. Explanation. Interview with the Asian designers revealed that their goal was to design something that fit within the stream of existing products. 8. European fashion designers are more when compared to Asian designers. A. Cross-trained. B. Multi-talented. C. Specialized. D. All of the above. Answer. A. Explanation. In France and England, fashion designers were trained to be pattern cutters and were expected to be able to take on this role, or at least demonstrate a high level of competency when working with a specialist pattern cutter. 9. Design thinking and practices are highly influenced by social and institutional environment, national and corporate culture, disciplinary culture, all of the above. Answer. D. Explanation. Figure reflects on how design thinking and practices are embedded within the cultural context. Each layer affects and is affected by the adjacent layers. 10. Teams are much valued as they closely work together even contributing outside their occupational boundaries. A. Multi-talented B. Multidisciplinary. C. Multitasking. D. None of these. Answer. B. Explanation. Multidisciplinary teams contribute outside their occupational boundaries such as mechanical engineers, may get involved in user studies and anthropologists might make contributions that would generally be made by industrial designers. Thanks for watching. Comment for any suggestions. Like, share and subscribe.